Oh, good evening, Paul. Good evening. Good evening. The scene which takes place after Paul tells Holly he loves her is all about covering up true emotion. Almost immediately after the door to her apartment closes, Paul hears screaming and furniture breaking and comes back up worried. Now although the scene takes place at nighttime, the apartment is well lit. Director Blake Edwards uses relatively quick cuts to communicate the chaos of Holly's tantrum. And as chaos ensues inside Holly's room and Paul wrestles her to the bed, she throws a lamp on the ground, shattering it to pieces and suddenly making the room dark. The abrupt transition to low-key lighting acts as a metaphor for Holly's internal struggle. The room was seemingly luminous, but all it took was a lamp to turn off for the truth to be revealed. Holly was never truly happy with her lifestyle, but attempted to cover up this fact with material possessions to hide or lighten her emotions. <laughs> when Holly lies down in bed and takes her hands off of her face, Edwards purposefully uses a close-up shot of her for multiple seconds to exemplify the sheer sadness and hopelessness she is facing. The next shot is a close-up of Paul that is meant to supplement the shot of Holly by indicating his clear distress about her emotional state through the character's facial emotions. By not using dialogue to convey meaning here like most of the film does, Edwards indicates that an important change for Holly is occurring within the scene. For the first time, she is unable to repress her feelings of emptiness. Received notice, young Fred killed. The second half of this scene reveals that Holly's brother has died, and we get a medium close-up shot of Paul's face to witness his sadness, followed by a quick shot of Jose. Join in the sorrow of our mutual loss. Letter following, love, Doc. All Jose has to say is, Oh. Which shows his general apathy towards Holly's well-being and his overall selfishness. The clothing in this scene is very important. Paul is wearing extremely simplistic clothing because every aspect of his life is simple and he's always true to himself. Holly's expensive, bright pink dress seems to exaggerate her social status to a point of satire. Holly lies isolated in bed wearing her dress, and the contrast achieved by Holly crying in her expensive clothing reveals how socialites mask their painful emotions by their wealth. The final shot is taken at a high angle, showing how empty Holly's room and therefore Holly is without her brother.